Hello everyone, how are you doing today? This is Steven with Divine Mobile Home Central. In today's video, we are out at Scott Build Factory Outlet in Waycross, Georgia. In today's video, we are going to be touring this beautiful single wide called the Cedar. The Cedar is a three bedroom, two bathroom, single wide manufactured home. So with, before we go inside, I want to get you all a good feel of the outside of the home briefly, very briefly. So of course you have your window right there, it's very nice. And this of course will be the rear elevation of your home. So of course that will be your door down there. Alright, so let's get inside, let's get to the good stuff, let's see what this home has to offer. If you are new here, my name is Steven. I do manufactured modular home tours and I also do general manufacturer home information videos. I invite you to join our family by subscribing, like, and comment commenting. A short disclaimer, I do not work for the manufacturer or dealer of this home. I record these videos because I love and enjoy touring these homes. If you have any additional questions about finding this home, pricing, or specifications, any information that I have will be down in the description box. Thank you very much. All right, so we just stepped inside the cedar. All right, so this is a living room. You got plenty of space in your living room. You can definitely put you like a nice size couch or you can put a couple of lazy boy chairs or, or you know, whatever you want to do. Plenty of space in this living room. Now this home would have the um, air vents in the floors, so I figured I'd point that out. And I always like to point out if the home have the air vents in the floors or in the ceilings. So that way you can decide for yourself what you want to buy. All right, get you all of you from another angle. All right. Now look at this living room. And of course right here, this would be your AC thermostat. But you know, like I always say in many other videos, I would definitely put an Ecobee. Very nice feature. All right, so let's check out the kitchen and dining room area. Over here, so this would be your kitchen area. Now it doesn't have a window of the kitchen sink, but you would have a peninsula right here. So your peninsula would be right here. Really love the, um, Little of the texture of the um, countertop. Of course, right here, this will be your kitchen sink. Have a nice size kitchen sink. Okay. Over here, you have your um, stove area, as well as your microwave. Hmm, that's different. I really like that. Definitely different. I really love the pattern of that too, the backsplash. And of course, you have your drawer space. And you'd have cabinet space. Okay, let's take a look at this area. All right, got plenty of space around your refrigerator. And of course, uh, another sample of the cabinet space. It also has space for decorations and decor on the top of your countertops. And you would have recessed lighting as well for the dinette area and as well as the uh, kitchen. Let's take a look over here at the utility room space. So this would be your utility room. Of course, a space right there for your washer and dryer. Okay. All right. 
All right, so let's go take a look over here. This will be your dining area. You probably put like a, um, you probably get away with a four seater, but I would say a two seater would probably be best for this area. And then of course you can put bar stools right there as well. So it depends on what your needs are and what you're looking for. So, all right, so let's go check out the, this area of the house. So of course this will be your hallway. Okay, this will be your bedroom. First guest bedroom. Of course, with any other home, this home is definitely energy efficient. So and it has thermal pane windows and it has uh, double insulation in the floors and the ceilings. All right, let's take a look at this closet. Nice, adequate size closet. All right, let's go check out some other bedrooms. Sorry, it is a little dark in here, but this would be your um, hallway guest bathroom. Of course, you would have your mirror, have your sink, as well as your commode. You also have a medicine cabinet up here too above the commode so. and you have your full fiberglass tub and shower combo and of course your shower head if there if there are any decoration pictures online that i can find i will definitely insert them in this video at the end of the video for you all right let's check out this other bedroom Now, this is definitely a, a larger of the two bedrooms on this side of the house. This room is huge, you guys. This bedroom is huge. Get y'all a better look here. Okay. Get y'all another look from an angle. All right. All right. So this is your closet. Okay. And let's go check. Get you all to look at the room. All right, so let's go check out the master. But before we do, if you've made it this far in a video and you like this video, I invite you to hit that subscribe button. And welcome to the family. We are very, very happy to have you here. And definitely feel free to drop a comment down below if you like this video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Um, I really appreciate it, and thank you. So let's go check out the master bedroom. All right, so before we enter the master bedroom, you have your utilities right here. You have your central heat and air, and you would also have your water heater, which would be right there behind the access panel. So this will be the entrance hallway to your master bedroom. Okay, this will be your master bedroom, you guys. Get y'all another view from another angle. So this, this is a very nice size master bedroom. Now those right there, those actually go into the master bathroom. They just have it sought right there until the, you know, the home is purchased by the customer. But once a customer purchases this home and is delivered, they will set everything up at the permanent location of its new homeowner. So this is a very nice size master bedroom. All right, let's take a look at the master bathroom. All right, this is your master bath. You have your commode right there. You have your garden tub. Very nice garden tub. And of course, you have your double sinks right here. So you got a sink right here 
you have a little space right here. You can put like a little bench and, you know, do your makeup, do your hair, uh, nails, you know, cut your hair, shave, whatever you want to do, whatever, whatever is best for you. So plenty of space to do it right here. And of course, here's your other, other double sink. So you got two sinks in this bathroom. And I love the fact that they have an extra mirror right there that's kind of like lower to the level of this um, uh, makeup station. That's very nice. Definitely a plus. Oh, uh, of course, over here will be your shower. So you got plenty of room in the shower. Here, let me show you all the sample. So I'm standing here in the shower and I have plenty of space. You see that? Got plenty of space in here, and I'm six foot three. Plenty of space in the shower. And of course, you'd have your shower head. And of course, you would have two benches as well. And this is full fiberglass. And again, your shower curtain, your um, shower doors will go right here once the home is, uh, is purchased. Overall, this is a very nice manufactured home. For, for a small family or a single person, this is absolutely perfect. The Cedar is a very, very impressive home. Now, unfortunately, I, there's not a price available in here, but if I'm able to find out, then I'll post it on the screen. If not, then the dealer's contact information and everything will be down in the description box. All right, you guys. Well, I'm going to see if I can look at one more house for today, and then I'll call it for today. So that will conclude the tour of the Cedar. This is Stephen with Divine Mobile Home Central, your central source for manufactured modular home tours and more. I'll see you all in the next video. Y'all take care and have a wonderful day. So chaser, you turn me on. Groove is your true nature. And it never gets hot enough for you. You've been enchanting this heart of mine for the longest time. Slow dancer, you stun me up with all your romancing.